It's days like today that I miss the Florida weather from last week. Gloomy, gray skies, raining, just not a fan. So it is like Monday afternoon. Noah and I went to the gym this morning, hit a good back and bicep workout. I worked out by myself, but to be honest, I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. It was a mess, um, went to the gym and like find a good mood. And for, I don't know, I just wanted to put like sad, music on when I was working out which was a mistake because I literally broke down in the middle of the gym and just started crying like just broke down I'm gonna talk about it I'm gonna try and talk about it later or I'll try and like talk right now about it but I just feel like I've been so busy I do have a restaurant job in Columbus now that I'm not in school I do YouTube and Instagram social media during the day and then I work at a restaurant at night just to save up some money for grad school and I genuinely love working there I'm a server and I like meeting new people I love the people I work with but sometimes it can just get like overwhelming like extremely overwhelming and I feel like I've been running myself to the ground for the past like few weeks like my voice is like completely gone yesterday I know I filmed a little bit we went to the mall and got some ice cream I did some returns which which is another headache because I couldn't even do my return. I didn't have my receipt, but we got some ice cream, came home, got some Chipotle, and then I, like, ended off vlogging from there. We baked some cookies that night. We just, like, Noah and I hung out. I napped. He did homework. We just, like, chilled inside, but, yeah, like, this morning, I just, like, hit a wall and, like, broke down and started crying in the middle of the gym, which, I don't know. I haven't done that in a while. Normally, it's, like, body image related but this morning was just I feel like I've been overworked and run down and I feel like God's plan was for me to do this and like inspire you guys and show you guys and take you guys along my life journey and like how I live a healthy lifestyle a balanced lifestyle what I do my family my friends Noah and I our relationship like literally everything and I just like hit that wall this morning I don't know why, I don't know where it came like from, I probably it was probably the mixture of sad girl music, my period's about to start, and like just everything was like going on in my life, but it is my goal to like just slow down, prioritize me, do what I love, do this, film, like I have a really cute crazy yoga haul in this video, like this is what I'm meant to do, I'm meant to inspire you guys, and... Yeah, that's my like little rant this morning, but just got home. And I'm gonna start this vlog off like on a proper note. Like yesterday we were just like chilling. But today I got a shower. I have to wash my hair. My hair is a dirty, greasy mess. That's why this hat is on. So we're gonna shower, do my little haul video later, showing you guys some new recipes, hanging out with Noah tonight. We're just doing everything. But I needed to show you guys this is the best stuff I think I've ever used. If you have not ever used Aquaphor as a lipstick, chapstick, whatever, you're missing out. It is the best. Like, I don't think it's meant to be chapstick, but it is the best thing for my lips. My lips are so dry in this spring season. It's like raining outside right now, but the air is just so dry. I'm telling you, Aquaphor is where it's at. Probably should be putting this on after I take a shower, but I need this right now. So, I know this is literally, I've been chit chatting for you for like almost four minutes, but let's take a shower, get started with my day, starting with the Monday. It is freezing outside, so that's why I still have my coat on, but hello you guys, welcome back to the vlog. I love you, and I'm sorry for like literally ranting your head off, but I needed to get that out there. So 
it's a little bit later and I'm gonna make a quick little like snack plate lunch I've just been doing these a lot recently I don't know why but this kind of looks like a mess a bunch of different things but I wanted to show you what I'm gonna make so first up we're gonna do like a chicken salad with cheese and a bell pepper on the side um, so I am gonna take this canned chicken breast that I get from Costco I'm not gonna use the whole thing but I'm gonna use some of this and I'm not a big fan of mayonnaise that is something that like about me if you know me I don't like melted cheese that cheese is fine melted cheese or mayonnaise not a fan of it but when it comes to like chicken salad tuna salad stuff like that I normally go for plain Greek yogurt because it tastes like it uses like the same consistency but added protein and I like this flavor better so I'm going to put some plain Greek yogurt in there and then seasonings I have dill parsley and salt and then I'm gonna chop some grapes up so that's gonna be like oh and I'm gonna throw almonds in there as well to add some like crunch and healthy fats so that is gonna be the chicken salad that's gonna be like the bulk of this snack plate chopping up some red bell pepper it's just like so beautiful I love bell pepper one of my favorite vegetables and I really don't know why but I've been craving cheddar cheese recently so I have this little like block of sharp cheddar cheese I'm just gonna chop into cubes and eat this I might like honestly snack on it I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna snack on it while I make all of this but cheddar cheese so this is gonna be today's lunch I'm gonna show you the final product okay you guys here we have it chicken salad peppers and I ate I snacked on the cheese while I was cooking. I feel like some crackers like on the side to tip in the chicken salad would be good. I didn't just like out, but I poured myself a little ginger lemon olipop. I'm telling you, I just took a sip. This tastes like ginger beer. Like this would be so good as like a Moscow mule. Ginger lemon olipop. Here are the nutritional facts. They are so good for a like healthy soda there's still like 16 carb in a soda but for like a normal ginger beer like a can is like 55 or 60 grams of sugar so such a good alternative but this is going to be the perfect like lunch mid-afternoon snack it's like 2 30 right now I feel like we have the perfect all white vibe going on right now with my hoodie, the wall behind me, and of course you guys know I'm always cozy and comfy, so I have a white blanket with me. But as you guys know from the title of this video, and literally in every single video that I'm working out, running errands, which is pretty much every single vlog, um, I'm wearing crazy yoga activewear. They are amazing. The quality, the price, the shipping, everything about them I love. I tend to grab my crazy yoga things more than my Lululemon or pretty much any other activewear. I'm obsessed with the colors, obsessed with the quality. If you guys don't have anything from crazy yoga, what are you doing? What are you doing? They're on Amazon, so the shipping is so so nice and all of these pieces i'm going to link down below with my sizes and the colors that i got because with the spring and summer season coming up these colors are perfect so without further ado let's get into the haul because there's a lot of stuff to go over so i know i said that i had a bunch of fun colors to show you but we're actually going to be starting off plain black and basic with their neutrals because there's nothing better than having neutrals for working out yes but especially for like running errands i wear these when i'm like chilling laying around the house running errands all the things so starting up i have a plain black pair in the butter Lux collection now there's two collections i'm showing you right now this is going to be the butter Lux, and the next one i'm going to be showing you is like that brushed naked feel line I love both. They're a little bit different. So this one, the Butter Lux, is definitely, like, stands for the name. Very buttery soft. So in this black color, here's the back of the leggings. You can see on the side, they come in a little bit. So when they're on your waist, they make you feel, like, very held in. This waistband is perfect. I'm telling you, it doesn't dig in whatsoever. I'm going to size a medium in all of the leggings that I'm going to be showing you. But especially in this Butter Lux line... They're so soft, make you feel held in, like I said. There's that logo, that crazy yoga logo on the back. Here's the front, just plain and simple. 
I'm obsessed with these leggings. I always like am reaching for the black pair I currently have and I'm like, oh, I wish I had another pair. So that's why I picked up two because I just wanted to have more. There is definitely nothing wrong with having two pairs of black leggings. So that is why I picked up a second pair along with the black in the same collection, same size, same everything. I got this olive gray color so i have a lighter gray and i have like a green like a dark green but nothing like in the middle so these are the perfect almost like a charcoal but has like green undertones so olive gray in the same medium same butter Lux collection here's that lo logo again and all of the leggings i've had from crazy yoga that have the same logo on the back of the leggings have never faded have never come off just goes to show like the quality is there so there is the logo on the back here's the front in that olive gray color now getting into the bright and fun colors starting up is this color in dark red now on camera it might look a lot lighter than it is it is definitely a bright and fun color especially for the spring and summer this color reminds me of the sunsets that were in like all of my florida vlogs i'm obsessed with sunrises and sunsets that is one thing that like puts me in such a good mood so this color reminds me of it here's the back here's the front and like i said this is going to be in the naked feel line the naked feel collection that crazy yoga has i'm obsessed with this color it is so bright so fun i feel like with a white or like an off monochromatic color this would be such a cute outfit but here we go and i have all the tags on here so i can tell you like the exact name color um like collection i have but i also tried these on so i'll put some of the try on clips in here as well so like i said size medium in the color dark red i am obsessed with this color is this matte purple i got the sports bra and the matching leggings to go along with it first up we're going to be talking about the sports bra i absolutely love this here is the front and a strappy back i'm telling you there's nothing better than a strappy sports bra it makes your back just look so pretty i think and like something different like when it's tight and super compressive i almost feel like i'm too squeezed in at the top and i'm someone who has like a larger chest so i'm like a pro when it comes to sports bras here's the back of it i love this crisscross i think i'm gonna wear this um purple like matching set to the gym tomorrow because it's so freaking cute so here's an up close it kind of matches my nails which is another reason why i love this color but super super cute for the springtime and the summer when we're getting into summer i got this sports bra in an extra large like i said now i have some sports bras from crazy yoga in a size large that fit me perfectly but kind of too tight around my like torso area around my rib cage so i sized up to an extra large and i'm glad i did just because it feels more comfortable i'm not someone who likes something super tight like i said so this is perfect so got this color size extra large in love and then with the matching color of the leggings this is in that brushed naked feel line the purple is super super cute super flattering as well like makes you like it's not like bright in your face like that other pair of leggings were but I feel like this here's the logo here's the back this with like a super cute jacket could just be worn like out and about too so cute for the gym cute for errands I'm in love with this color again I think it's so fun how it like matches my nails but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be wearing this to the gym tomorrow especially because tomorrow i have an upper body workout as well so this one will be really really cute all right so we hit like orange the neutrals purple and now hitting this beautiful red color so this is very similar i think it's the same style bra it is the same style bra just in a different color so this color is crimson it's super cute being from ohio graduating from ohio state growing up in cincinnati all of the sports teams colors here is some sort of shade of red so i thought this would be super cute for like when game time comes in the fall time but also to wear to the gym so 
red is a super super flattering color i think and especially this shade of red like it's not super in your face so it can like match with neutrals very subtly and it's not like in your face red and lastly this i actually was not sent but i bought with my own money because i'm obsessed with patterns as well especially when they're matching i actually got this outfit for when i went to florida but we never went and like actually worked out when we were down i brought it with me but i never wore it so i was like you know what i'm just gonna throw this into the haul because it's crazy yoga you guys i'm obsessed i bought these off of amazon look at this tiger like zeep not tiger like zebra print with the blue and like black i think the exact color of it is bright purple and blue zebra stripes so when you're on amazon and looking i'll link it down below but like I said, this is that exact color. I got these leggings in a size medium again. I am obsessed with these. They're super stretchy. These are so, so nice. They feel such, like almost like a second skin to your body. And I got the matching sports bra. I mean, come on. Matching sports bra with, like I'm going to stand out in the gym in such a good way when i wear this together now this is going to be a different style bra than the other bras that i got all of those bras are the same style this one is a little bit different so you can see it's a very more minimal which having a bigger chest can be risky but when you wear it correctly and when it fits you correctly i think it can look very elegant and beautiful so here it is here's the front this one definitely has a shorter like band to it, but I tried it on and I'm obsessed with it. I ne I didn't include like try-ons in for the sports bras in this because I thought that when I wear it to this gym, like you guys can see how it fits, how I move in it, all of that kind of stuff. But here's the front and this one is a lower cut strappier back so i think that is the exact like style name of this sports bra i can't remember it off the top of my head but like i said i'll put it on the screen and i'll put it down below for you but i got this one in an extra large as well and i'm just obsessed with it there are pads that come in these sports bras but i'm someone who i like to take them out but super super cute i'm telling you i'm obsessed with this matching look but I think that is it for this little like try on unboxing just showing you some of my new staples that I got from crazy yoga You guys know I wear crazy yoga all the time I talk about them all the time in so many cute different colors that I already have and so I'm excited to add this Into my wardrobe into my collection and Noah and I are gonna be going to the gym tomorrow together So he's gonna see me in that like purple matching set. I think he's gonna think it's super cute He likes when I wear color to the gym he always thinks it like makes me stand out but i'm gonna go pick him up actually from class here soon so i hope you guys enjoyed this little like portion of the vlog of crazy yoga because i'm telling you guys if you do not have anything from them yet you need to get them i'm obsessed with them